<sighs> it is <clears throat> just after 12 o'clock and the new Sony firmware is available. 3.0. So what 3.0 is supposed to include is Evolved AF and real-time eye detect autofocus. Uh, and this is for the a7 III. We're missing a couple things that the other cameras have, but it is what it is. But uh, we're supposed to have animal eye detect autofocus, which should be kind of cool. We'll see. And what else? Yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, there's some minor bug, fix bug fixes and, and stuff. What I'm hoping for, this is... I don't know. I mean, with all this autofocus stuff, it's super cool that they're doing it, but you know what I'd really like? I'd like the little gray autofocus square thing to not be gray anymore. That's my goal. I don't want it to be gray and then turn to green. I want it to be like white or better yet. I would like it to be able to change colors. Let's see if they offer that on this update. It's a little surprise for the A7 III. You never know, they might do it. We will see. And I've already downloaded the software. So we're gonna go ahead and open that up and let me get rid of some of these other windows. While editing, I have also been binge watching Game of Thrones behind the scenes because well, that's kind of what you do late at night so here's the update let's go ahead and open that opening update and do update setting tool real quick go ahead and open it it's going to ask me for a password i should probably select the box first Boom. And connect the device to the computer with the USB cable. I'm one of those crazy people who, first thing I ever do with my cameras is I tear the doors right off of them because they annoy the hell out of me. Go ahead and turn that on. And I'm going to just go ahead and click OK. Then we're gonna hop into resources and we're gonna click on the system software updater. Let's see what this does. Go ahead and open. Let's, oh, let's bring that up here. Go to, so. Turn on camera, select USB connection from setup in the camera menu screen which, you know what, I'm not entirely sure. Uh, let's see. Okay. So, menu. Hop over here to USB connection. And it wants me to set it to mass storage. And that's pretty much the only setting it wants. So I'm going to go ahead and plug that in. Then I'm going to click next, verifying the connection of the camera. All right. It says uh, verify the current version. Yes, I am on 2.1. And version after update is 3.0 next camera will reset auto magically and that's what it's doing it's resetting oh my goodness it's a little late obviously is this in focus i can't tell if this is
Oh no, the camera caught fire. That'd be funny. <sighs> okay, you probably shouldn't blow vape smoke. Or mist, if you will. Under your camera. But I digress. That would be kind of funny. I might use that as the cover photo. We're almost at 100%. Let's see what the camera does. Oh, we're so close. It's just a little, just a tiny, tiny bit away. This is it, people. Don't touch the camera. Resist the urge to touch the camera. We're almost there. We're almost at the finish line. That's it. All right. Looks like the camera is turning on. And finish. Really? What? It doesn't give me like a little celebration dance or anything. It just like, it's done. All right, there we go. So the camera's updated. Let me go ahead and I'm going to turn it off first. Then I'm going to unplug it from the computer. It just feels like the right thing to do is to turn it off and then unplug it. But let me go ahead and turn on the camera now. And I'm expecting that over here in the autofocus menu, we'll be able to see some interesting things here. Face eye AF settings. What do we got here? Animal eye display on. Face detect frame display on. Subject detection human. Oh, you could switch it over to animal. Has a little picture of a kitty there. Kind of cool. I'm going to leave it on human for now. Oops. So. So face priority in autofocus. On and off. Subject detection. Oh, we already looked at that. Um, yeah, pretty much. I mean, this is the big part of the update here. I suppose there's probably some other stuff in here. But uh, let's see what. Let's see if. No, nothing was really. I don't see anything really with uh, in video settings. So we just got all the same stuff in video settings, nothing new. Um, but let me see, let me bring that shutter speed way down. And I'm gonna go to, I don't know, I'll call this flexible spot. It's still freaking gray. Look at that. Meaning, oh, where'd it go? It's against a dark background. Oh, there it is. You can only see the autofocus box against the bright background. Damn it, Sony. God damn it. Seriously. You know what most of us want, Sony? We want a freaking box, an autofocus box that you can actually see, and we want a flippy screen. That's what we want. I'll be able to take better photos of my dogs now. Thanks, guys. See ya.